Hello my loves, it's Kasha, Planarista 101. Today we are going to be going through um, 10 of my favorite Happy Planner sticker books. <clears throat> These are the ones that I truly, truly love and I reach for often. The first one is Modern Peach and this is one of my favorites. Not only is it beautiful, but has both functional and decorative stickers and some of them are actually two in one um and those black florals are to die for at least for me if any of these books that i'm going to be going through today are your favorites leave me a comment down below i would love to know if you guys have other suggestions of favorite books leave me also a comment down below i would love to know what you what's your guys's favorite for me I'm not sure I'm mixed between florals and neutrals <clears throat> so again those black florals are probably my favorite out of that book and I can't get enough of it I do have multiple copies the second one is the glitter paint and this is a very very bright book but in a different way than normally happy planner it is bright these um are very vibrant bright colors and they made even though these are like such a bright colors they still made them pretty functional for the most part there's a lot of boxes in here there's a lot of decorative stickers that are not too big and don't take too much space and there's bullet points and everything is <clears throat> color themed so you could make several spreads out of this. This is really, really gorgeous. So yeah, there's um, boxes and decorative stickers in there as well. My next one is my floral book, but I'm going to have to show you a backup because my floral book is pretty much empty. There's not much left in there. I truly do use this book all the time so i do have a backup and i think i already sunk into the backup as well yeah there's some florals missing already so i pretty much am using two of those books right now this is one of my favorites for obvious reasons i love florals and how much more perfect could this be the next one is the Free Spirit book. And the Free Spirit book has a lot of stickers that are very pastel and neutral in color. And it's very muted. And I do enjoy this quite a bit. It has so many functional stickers but it also has decorations so it's a win-win for both again you could make several spreads with this book and the colors in this are beautiful so if you don't want to go for bold you i would reach for this one and then we have fun florals and i don't really use this book enough at all and i think um it's because i'm trying to hoard my stickers I truly, truly love this book and all of the stickers in here are gorgeous. I'm not the biggest fan of these realistic flower stickers, but other than that, this book is absolutely gorgeous and I need to, like, especially these, I need to sink in into it a little bit more and start using it and stop worrying about running out of stickers. That will never happen. Look at these roses, they're beautiful. And then we have those little flowers. I think they're like cherry blossoms. <clears throat> and then I've seen these flowers in another sticker book before. I believe it might be one of the mega sticker books. But this is all just so gorgeous. So we have fun florals, and again, you could make lots and lots of decorative spreads with this. And then I have Vintage Botanicals, and that book has been loved so much. I also have the planner from 
bat collection and i am pretty obsessed with this book it's just again pastel yet bold and then all of those wild flowers are beautiful it has boxes it's it's really a unique book and it's very different from anything that happy planner has released i guess because even the boxes in this book like the first couple pages are black and we don't see too much of just fill in blank black boxes from happy planner so it's different <clears throat> the next sticker book is the seasonal and i know this is an oldie but a goodie and it has both decorations and functional stickers which is amazing and then it's divided into seasons on top of it I mean, it can't get much better than that. So this book um, is very much well organized. Look at these flowers too. They remind me a little bit of the ones from the previous book. And it just has a whole story. And then you get a page of celebrating. And I have two pages because I have two of those books. But yeah, so on top of it, you get a bonus as well. This is a very, very awesome book to have. If you don't have it, this is one I would highly, highly recommend. Well, all of the ones that I'm showing today. And then we have Rung Rung Seasonal. And that book, as you can see, is very loved by me. It's missing very many stickers as well. And these girls are just beautiful. And I think it's because, again, it's seasonal and it's so easy to plan when things are seasonal for me that I tend to gravitate towards this book. I mean, then you have even those off holidays like St. Patty's Day and Valentine's Day. They have those decorations for there. And then there's a the whole summer. I mean, look how fun this is. And then you have boxes and checklists. And then in the back of the book, you have every holiday and then season. And then they also include a dinner, celebrate, party. And then you have the seasons as well. So you have birthday of autumn and spring and so on. And I think that's beautiful. So that's another book that's very much loved by me. And of course, colorful boxes. This book has pretty much no stickers left. There's maybe 20 stickers out of the 500 left. And I also use the borders um, on my pages. So it actually gives me double of the stickers in there. So that's pretty nice. And I think I have three copies of that book. Um, <clears throat> the last but not least, and I don't know if that's cheating or not, but this is a sticker book and it's the Super Mega Rainbow. And I love it because it absolutely has everything and it's divided by color. It's pretty easy to go and find what you need. So we have box stickers and checklists and then we have monthly boxes and square boxes with some headers and you get two pages of everything so it just makes it so much easier to plan and then you have actual box stickers just like in the previous book and then you get another two pages of shape of shape boxes which is awesome and then you get icons and then you get bullet points. So it's a whole page of bullet points. It's amazing. And then you get some quotes. And again, two pages of that. Another two pages of clear quotes. You have the alphabet. One is on paper and one is foiled. And then you have sprinkled dots. And then it goes into the next color. And it's the same thing. Obviously, the sayings in the boxes change, but the colors have exact same pages as far as functionality. 
And those are all of my books. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope um, that this encourages to get the ones that you truly need. Or if you have them, it inspires you to use them. And like I said, leave me a comment down below if you have any of these and those are also your favorites. Or if not, leave me a comment what your favorites are. Again, thanks for watching. And if you're new to, to my channel, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye!